okay, how do we multiply those two numbers? This number, let's put a period here. Okay. So this is 142,857 multiplied by 63. And this number is a very special number. First is called a cyclic number. It's a cyclic number. I'll show you why it's called a cyclic number. And then another one is also called Caprica number. So this is a very famous number. If we calculate 142, with different numbers, let's say with the two, with one, of course, is itself. With two, we will get 285, 714. If we multiply by three, we get a 428,571. If we multiply by four, we get 571,428. If we multiply by five, we get 714,000, 285 multiplied by 6 we're getting 857,142 if we multiply this number with 7 very special and very important we get 999,000 999 okay so we want to use this property okay. so 63 can be written as 7 times 9 okay. To multiply those two, seven multiplied by this, we get this. So that's 999,999 multiplied by nine. Also, we don't really want to multiply these numbers. Okay, so what do we do? We want to change nine to be 10 minus one. Then, Well, just add zero to this, then multiply those two numbers. Now we move this comma. So we now get a nine million, 999,990. Then minus, minus one times this number, which is just 999,999. So how do we subtract those two numbers? So this has six digits, this has seven digits. And we know if we have one meaning minus this one, that's just one. So we want to split one meaning from this. So we'll get a million, plus one meaning, right? One meaning minus this one, that's just one. Between the end, we get a million, 